Welcome, everybody, or should I say welcome back to Project Zomboid. So over the past couple of days, I've actually been busy with another another collaboration, let's call it that, which hopefully you guys will see uh, either, either tomorrow or the day after or sometime anyway. Um, so I haven't had much chance to actually play Project Zomboid, but I have had chance to do a good amount of research into mods uh, and, and kind of what people recommend playing with. So, I've written up a short list of mods. We're going to kind of check them out piecemeal. Uh, kind of kind of take a couple at a time here. Just to get a feeling for what they do. And then if I ever design some, you know, larger mod packs, kind of RimWorld style. We can always take a look at them. Always, always take a look at them all together. See, see how kind of a complete experience plays during that. So, for today, what I've got is a highly recommended mod. Lots of people sending me this over Discord. And that is the Super Survivors mod. Which essentially adds survivors into Project Zomboid. I was actually quite surprised that the game... Didn't already have that. During the time we played as Demarcus Duffelbag. I know that wasn't his actual name, but that's why everyone's been calling him. So that's his new canon name. When we were playing as Demarcus Duffelbag, one thing I was always looking out for was was survivors, was NPCs, you know, people in the map that even if we couldn't recruit, you know, just to, you know, maybe save, get some items from, or hostile enemies with, with guns, say, for example, just trying to survive. I was quite surprised to learn that wasn't already part of the game. So this mod essentially adds all of those things I just talked about. Survivors out there, when they're in the wasteland, they will look for food water they will obviously try and try and defend themselves they'll be sometimes armed sometimes not and more importantly you can recruit them and play with a kind of party of people who will who will obviously work for you but obviously you need to feed and defend them so let's take a look here now i think what we'll do is just go for the same settings we basically had last time we'll go survivor we'll play on um we'll play on this one muldra Mul oh did we play riverside last time i think we did didn't we well let's go for this one because it's got... No, actually, I like the look of this one better in hindsight. That one seems quite densely packed down there. Let's go for this one. Uh, Riverside, Kentucky. And see what we've actually got going for us then. So I've thrown together a quick class here based on a lot of feedback I've read online. A lot of feedback from you guys as well for what are essential survival skills. So to start off with here for occupation, I've gone for Part Ranger. Gives us axe, carpentry, foraging, and trapping. Now, the real bonus to this class is apparently when combined with the TV shows that give you education and things like, you know, carpentry cooking. That's quite a potent combination because you're essentially, you've got all the skills you need to survive. Trapping and foraging for the food and then, of course, cooking as well is nice to counteract some of the things I'm about to talk about in a second. But this, in turn, gives you all the survival skills you will ever need. So that seems, that seems very, very good. So we are absolutely going to stick with Part Ranger. And this may be anecdotal, but every run we've ever done in Project Zomboys, I, I found an axe very early on we found multiple axes as demarcus stuffle bag so i'm more than happy to take part ranger for that axe skill so we've got a weapon and kind of utility tool there as well now the traits are where things get a bit more nebulous let me try and explain these choices and how it was explained to me and the things i've read how they've explained them as well so high thirst we actually never really had a problem with it as demarcus stuffle bag we, we were always well well watered <laughs> <laughs> for lack of a better word. We've got a few perks that kind of combo as well. So we've got slow healer and hemophobic. So fear of blood. Doesn't really matter if we don't get hurt, which we're going to try and actively avoid anyway, because that's how you lose the game. But more importantly, we've got slow healer as well. So we will have to be a bit more cautious with how we play. But that in turn has given us many, many more bonuses, which in this situation, I believe the negatives will um be be far outweighed by the positives so these three all kind of go together and kind of contribute to the same play style smoker contributes unhappiness when you don't smoke for a while not only did we find a ridiculous amount of cigarettes as demarcus duffel bag but i think i don't think unhappiness was really a problem more so than finding food and water you know so that's going to be a big concern. Weak stomach ties nicely into the thing I was talking about before. If we can forage and trap, we can cook food when we learn from the TV as well. Weak stomach might not be too relevant. It's not like we're going to be eating raw rats or raw food just to survive. We've got the skills necessary to hopefully facilitate a decent food income. Then I've gone for slow reader as well, just because that's kind of a... Yeah, it's kind of a, a relatively safe one, I think. You're always going to be sat down somewhere safe, simple to read books. And who cares if it takes, you know, slightly longer. If it was, say, I don't know, quadruple the time, maybe that's a bit of a concern. But even then, a lot of, if we're picking up our skills from TV, it might not be ultimately necessary. We've then got Dexterous, Lucky, Athletic, and Strong. Also apologize now very briefly if I keep pausing just to uh, kind of steady myself a little bit. I've I've still got a problem with, with, my, with my tooth. I had an infection in it recently. Um, and it's locked down in the country right now and my dentist is closed. So I've got to wait for <laughs> another half a month before I can potentially 
go and see someone to sort it out. So I'm just going to live my life in pain. It makes talking very difficult, which is uh, not a problem because it's not as if I need to talk very frequently. So we've got Dexterous, Lucky, Athletic, and Strong here as well. Uh, Dexterous, I was told, is is basically just a good one to take if you've got spare points, which I which I actually did when I built this. We, we had two points left over. Um... I, everyone's saying take slow really so i just took it and then i thought okay we've got two spare points we'll throw it into dexterous um so lucky is apparently very good for finding good loot might contribute to us finding say an axe earlier um more importantly food water that type of thing now athletic and strong i've been told are obviously incredibly good they're both plus 10 each they're the only two plus 10 perks in the game run faster we can run for longer, you get plus four fitness, and strong gives us extra knockback from melee weapons, combos nicely with potentially lucky and our axe skill there, and we've got the plus four strength, so we are going to hit hard. Uh, we've just got to get an axe. We get an axe, we're golden. Let's take a look then, see what we've got. Ye Eras. Eras? I have no idea. I'm going to call you... She's very green, isn't she? She's very green indeed. I'm going to call you Cucumber Cordelia. Let's get straight into the game here. I love the idea of our characters always being just a random object as their as their first name, just random noun, cucumber, duffel bag. This is going to be a great naming scheme for all of our Project Zomboid characters, of which, of course, we're going to have no more because uh, Cucumber Cordelia here is going to live potentially forever. Oh, shit, we're in. Okay. Okay, chill. Chill, Cucumber. Let's take this slowly. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Okay, I've got to remember quite how things go down here. Right, we're looking for any sort of immediate weapon. This doesn't seem like the best area to have spawned in, I'll be honest with you. It seems very busy. Lighter, plank, sheet of paper. Okay, oh shit. Okay, avoid the windows. We got a butter knife. A butter knife is something. Get it get it equipped. Okay, we've, we've got something to defend ourselves with. Let's be very careful exploring these areas. Electronics magazine. That seems pretty good. Lead pipe is a weapon. Is that better than what we've got? I assume so. Let's, let's go ahead and equip that. Better than a butter knife? I bloody hope so. Um, we've got a metal pipe. I guess it doesn't really matter too much. What's what's the damage comparison? I really shouldn't be worried about this type of thing, should I? Lead pipe. Um, damage is roughly the same. Yeah, I think it's actually identical. Okay. Good luck, little Cordelia. Let's see what we can do. Open door. What have you got for me? Absolutely nothing at all. Okay. And finally, we've got a bedroom. Oh, this is quite large. Be careful. We're looking for any sort of... Any sort of uh, clothing as well, I guess, wouldn't hurt. Spare clothing like a jacket would definitely be quite good. Take some Lego. God, I hope there are any... Uh, can there be zombies in the starting house? That's like a little walk-in cupboard type thing. The bathroom? It's in the bathroom. Nothing. Nothing in the bathroom. Damn, I'm already like... Uh, I'm already worried about this run. This doesn't... I, I will admit, I was expecting the ranger to start kind of... You know, maybe... Not, not necessarily... Oh, Jesus. Not necessarily armed... Um, but maybe not in the middle of a city with just a shirt on her back. What type of rain ranger are you? What has she got? Oh, Jesus. No, this is very... A plunger is a weapon. I mean, almost worth it for the comedy relief, but I'm, I'm, I'm gonna... We've got magazine. Yeah, take that. Mechanics. Take that. For intermediate. Ooh, that, that's probably a little bit, a little bit too difficult for us. Okay, get the, get the, get the noodles. What's we got in here? Can opener. Cereal. Coffee. Here we go. Coffee lowers fatigue. Are there any drawbacks to that? Because if there's no drawbacks, I'm going to take that. Can I take one can opener? Okay, well, we've got salt, vinegar. That's not really very useful, is it? Use a salt maybe as a... I don't know, like a disinfectant, perhaps? Let's grab that. What else have we got in here? Kitchen knife scissors could be quite good. Damn, none of this is... Oh, let's take the... um, Grab the towel. That could always come in handy. Shit, is that really all that's in here? Okay, let's get out. Can I, can I open this? Oh, it's locked. Come on. Come on, get, get us out of here, cucumber. Oh, shit. Okay, let's try one of the bedroom windows. I don't know. I, I know that you can keep basically trying windows until they open. Um. Oh, there we go. Okay, good shit, good shit. Get out of here. Okay. Out into the great beyond. We are looking for... Oh, no. Survivors, weapons, tools, you name it. I want it. Let's go house to house. We, we know that we can fight zombie by zombie. So there's no need to be really too afraid there. Okay, nothing in here. Yeah, I don't think we can actually pick doors, can we? So let's try this window. Hey, there we go. Good shit, good shit, good shit. Get us in there. <gasps> Not a fan of that. Is that an alarm or a phone? Someone trying to call? Okay, okay, careful. Could be a zombie. Oh, the front door's open. 
Chicken. At least I got chicken. What have we got in here? Carrots, soup, spaghetti, vinegar. That's good. Matches. That seems pretty good as well. What do you got for me? Fresh milk. That's a terrible... I, of all the things to take with you in the event of an apocalypse, fresh milk is probably, probably the bottom of my list, I'll be honest with you. Okay. Zombies in the bathroom. Nothing's in that. Okay. And we checked in here. Well, that's obviously where we came from. God, this is this is already intense. What's in here? What the hell is this? Oh, it's like a utility cupboard. Uh, nothing. Okay. Did I even go in there then? Oh, no, I didn't. Golf club. Hey, that's what we're after. Equip him both hands. I'm going to kill a man. Ah, uh, duct tape. tape. Take the duct tape. Excellent, excellent, excellent. Okay. Golf club seems like a pretty good starting weapon. I won't lie. It's a zombie being killed there. Okay, climb, climb the fence. Let's take this slowly. Look for survivors. That's what we're here for. There's a shed over there. If we're going to find tools anywhere, it'll be it'll be in a shed. Get out the foliage. I know you're a ranger, but good God. We don't need to take every opportunity. Okay, let's try a window. Okay, I think this zombie's uh, pretty much pretty much locked in. Prepare yourself, cucumber. We know how to do this now. We push. We push. Push. Oh, no. Yes, push and bludgeon. Oh! No, 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 no! Fuck off. Don't you dare. Is this one dead? I don't think it's dead quite yet. Get out of here. Okay, that one's down. Oh my god, he's an expert. All my training, I remember it. Red digital watch. Yes, thank you. Equip. Where? Left wrist. Good shit. Long sleeve t-shirt. Get it on. Nice work, nice work, nice work. There we go, that's something. What have you got? Jeans. It gives us better defense. Get it on. Holy shit, he's already doing so well. I've learned so much from Duffelbag Demarcus. Okay. Get that window open. Get yourself indoors. Let's close that window up. And let's let's close ourselves in for a second. Just so that we can explore without the fear of uh well, zombies and shit, to be honest with you. Foraging. We might actually genuinely be able to read that seeing as we're uh seeing as we're a part ranger. Okay, we're just gonna clear this house out of potential zombie foes. Let's get these curtains closed quickly, cucumber. Oh! You don't need to stand right in front of them to close them, you big fool. I want to make sure this house is clear. I'm not falling into the trap we fell into before of... Okay, okay. He's distracted. Uh, close the curtains. Okay, and I assume that door doesn't look as if it has anything, any, any way to block it up. What have we got in here? Bathroom? Fine. Covered. And then in here... Okay, we've got our utility room. Um, nails are a wooden mallet. A mallet seems pretty good. That seems like something we'd be able to build things with. So I'm definitely going to take that. Advanced trapping. That seems incredible for us as well. What have we got in here? Disinfectant. The hell just keeps disinfectant. Sorry? <laughs> what have we got? Fresh chicken. That doesn't seem doesn't seem the best food stuff. Okay. Canned tuna. Great. Sugar. Full of calories. I love it. Uh, what else we got? A fish fillet. Give me that. Bleach. And pop. Mmm. Tasty. Non-branded pop product. Okay. Good work, people. Let's go out the back door. Let's go out the back door. We've, we've drawn a lot of attention to the front of the house. You see any survivors? Oh my god, that place is uh, well and truly locked down. There might be a survivor in there. Do you think there could be implications of survivors? What's going on there? It's like a guy sat down. We've got to keep an eye out for kind of big groups. Because that might be, uh, especially if there are like zombies walking past that we haven't aggroed. That could be a fairly big... Oh! Careful. That could be a fairly big uh, indicator that we've got some friends nearby. Well, maybe soon to be friends. They could also just shoot us dead. Nice work. You know what? Dealing with zombies actually isn't too bad when you've got a weapon with reach. We need to get ourselves a drink. Bear in mind that this character does get a little bit thirsty, a little bit quicker. Especially with all this exercise. Got a lot of cardio in earlier. There we go. Okay, what have you got for me? Clip on tie, silver ring, suit pants. Formal shirt, baggy jeans, so useless. Anything else? Tank top? No, it's okay. We're all right. Thank you. I want to find another duffel bag. Or to be honest, any sort of backpack. Anything that we can carry things with. Let's try in here. Okay, no zombies immediately. Come on, get yourself in there. Oh, PvP forced on? What the hell does that mean? If you triple tap it, it turns PvP on or something like that. Okay, I've never seen that before. Might also allow us to fight other survivors. Not entirely sure. Shit. Okay. Let's try this. Let's try this window instead. I know that we can. Oh, there we go. Can we even climb in through there? Oh, very nice. Okay, what have we got? Scrap electronics, V3 remote control. Not entirely sure what I can do with that. Crafted trigger. 
crafted timer. Just broken into the house of uh, the uni bomber. What have we got here? Uh, Engineer's magazine. Give me that. And then we've got fresh corn. That's what we like to see here in Kentucky. I have no idea if Kentuckians like corn. Who doesn't like corn? Hello. Antibiotics. Fantastic. Great find. I don't like this. It's, it's, it's eerily quiet. Advanced cooking. Expert cooking. Come on. Get me that. No, no, no. No, no, no. Expert cooking. Of course, we would find all these cool skill books when, uh, when we're a slow reader. Brilliant. Stress reduction, unhappiness. I don't want to carry... Look at how much weight we've got carrying right now, though. We've got to be very, very careful. How do people not have bags in their houses? I have about 10 fucking backpacks in my house. What's wrong with you people? Right, get yourself a sippy. Get yourself a sippy. And let's get on the open road. Uh, how, how do I sippy again? Uh, no, 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 no. Sippy. Uh, sip, sippy. Walk on. Oh, right, of course. You can't drink from a kitchen sink. Sorry, that. how does that make any sense? Right, here we are. Nobody drinks from a kitchen sink. Always the superior, slightly warm bathroom water. To be fair, we've already kind of, uh... You know, we've already tidied this neighborhood up, you know. We could just live here. Fuck it. Okay. Now, this was the house that was absolutely swarming with them. There may be survivors, or it may just be a house swarming with zombies. One or the other. Oh, hello! What's wrong with this guy? He's got, like, a... A halo or something. Oh, it's a bandana. I got it. Okay. <laughs> It's an angel. Bandana, head, fingerless gloves, a bloody jacket. Oh, that's good. Yeah, give me that. Um, fingerless gloves. I don't see why you wouldn't put them on. A little bit of, little bit of defense there. Um, what did we just pick up that I wanted to? Oh, my God. We've picked up so much loot. Tank top wet. Wet from what? Wet from all this cardio, I assume. Very nice. Um, Ranger pants. You can get rid of those. What about to these Ranger pants? Uh, give, me, give me this bloody jacket. Right. Ranger shirt. Yeet it. Get out. Lead pipe. Not using it. Get out. Shit, sure there's something else we can drop here. Holy shit, we got like our shop's worth of stuff. That pinhead. Hello? Take him down. Okay, okay. On the back. On the back. Nice, good cave. What have we got here? Another digital watch. But, uh, watch on both arms because it's always time to smash zombies. Careful, 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 careful. D get back. Sir. Have you got a gun? What the fuck was that you were pointing at me? Oh, God, there's a lot of them. I may be biting off... A bit more than I can chew. That's probably a horrible metaphor to use in the middle of this situation. Oh, no. Get him away. Although, they're, they're, I will admit they're... Oh, my fucking good lord. Well, this is what you get for coming to the house that I quite clearly said earlier is swarming with zombies. Okay. Let's get some distance. Damage him wherever we can. Damage him wherever we can. We could really do with a survivor to come and bail us out. Probably a man with a big gun. Or a lady with a big gun. Generally, anybody with a big gun right now. I've already fucked it. We're already dead. Fucking Christ. They really did just swarm out of nowhere, didn't they? Wow, there was a lot of them. Oh my god, what is that going on up there? Oh my god, it's a survivor. Okay, that's his fault. That's his fault. I bet he came through here, aggroed the horde. Wow, imagine the last thing you see as a survivor is another person being just devoured. Wouldn't give you much hope. We, we might have accidentally and directly killed that man up there. <laughs> okay. Now, remember the last time we played as Demarcus, we were just kind of sitting out in the uh, in in the rural areas, right? With uh, oh, Freddy Pack. What about Freddy Backpack? Freddy Backpack, distant relative of Demarcus Duffelbag, perhaps. Even though they've got completely different names, don't question it. All right, here we are. Right, Freddy. That was my warm-up character. That was my warm-up character. Now we're into full-blown character situation. Okay, we've got a laundry room. You hear that? It's like gunshots already. What the hell's going on out there? Okay, what have you got? Diamond patter sweater. Love sweaters. Get it on. A pillow. What, is, what does that say? Dr. Dr. Dids? <laughs> okay. You do you, Dr. Dids. I hope you survive. Another clock. Excellent, excellent. Okay, some spare socks. Don't really think I'm quite desperate enough for that quite yet. Blue pen. I'm going to try and not take everything that isn't nailed down this time. You know, taking the fresh chicken or the carton of milk, probably not the most ideal situation. A tactical walkie-talkie, did that say? Hello? Besides that, though, absolutely nothing. We've got a rubber band. My guy just taught me that's all you need to build yourself a firearm. Okay, what have we got in here? Hello? I really hope we don't just open one of these as a zombie on this side. Toilet paper. We could hoard it and sell it to people for six times the price. Right, what have we got in this kitchen? Um, corn or a meat patty. Or as we would call it, a burger. 
Right, what have we got? Uh, red, red wine. Stay close to me, except not today, because I haven't got a duffel bag. Matches, give me that. Can opener. No, 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 brother, brother, brother. I don't know what you're picking up. We haven't got room for this crap. Uh, am I not wearing that? What about my diamond sweater? Put that on. Long socks, put them on. Uh, oh, I've just swapped my socks for someone else's socks. Well, whatever you've got to do to get yourself through the apocalypse, friend, I'm not going to judge you. Peanut butter. Give me some of that. Sugar as well. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And coffee. Uh, we've already got a can opener. Tea bags. What, we just munch on those? You're just going to eat a tea bag. I couldn't think of... Uh, that actually makes me feel a little bit unwell. Oh, maybe we should take the wine. No, we're fine. We're fine. We're not quite that desperate yet. Okay, books. Helps to have a book. What have we got? Sugar again. Hey, give me that. Super, super high calorie. A spoonful of sugar quite famously makes the medicine go down. Unless you're infected, at which point it probably won't help anymore. Right, get me out of here. Get it. Go through. And here we are. Why are they heading in that direction? They're heading in that direction. That could be indicative of something. Is there a survivor? Survivor? Oh my god above. I don't want to be here. <laughs> right, let's go back through this house and give them the old razzle dazzle. Are they? Oh no. <laughs> Hello, sir. Okay, see if we can lose them. Oh, there's bloody loads. Oh, this is chaos. Now I see why my good friend DeMarcus Duffelbag was sensible enough to... Right, close that window. No! Oh! Close the window. Oh! Sorry, I haven't got a weapon. Sorry, I've not got a weapon. Okay, out the window. Oh god, there's one right there. Okay, go, go, go. Get in. Or more specifically, get out! Okay, okay, I've already balls this up. I've already balls this up. Get out of here, fella. The outhouse. The outhouse. Then I can ship myself in peace rather than screaming around in the street. Okay. Okay. Open sesame. Give me a weapon, damn it. Brother, I need a weapon. Okay. Is this dangerous? Yes, it is. No risk, no reward. You know how it goes. Um. Oh, fuck. There was no reward. Cigarettes! Oh, damn it. The one thing I actually needed. Oh, he's ready for Christmas. Unfortunately, for Christmas this year, we're getting is probably... Pain. Oh, la, 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 la. A fresh kill. A fresh kill. A fresh kill. Hello. I like the look of a fresh kill. <gasps> Liam. Liam. Let me save you. Get out of Liam's way. He's my good friend. Oh, shit. Has he just been bitten? Liam, you have caused some real chaos here, pal. Uh, friends. Friends. friends Liam. Liam. Liam, talk to me, brother. I can't, he won't talk to me, he won't talk to me. Is he hostile? Is that the red thing? Oh, wait, is that because I've got PvP on? Is this this button? Oh, yeah, Liam. He won't fucking talk to me. I have spoken to survivors before in, in testing, and, and I've never had this problem where they've just straight up ignored me. To be fair, it is almost certainly because we're being chased by a shitload of zombies. That, I think, is reasonable. Watch the glass. Oh, you motherfucker. Um, we got cigarettes, though. And a lighter, more importantly. Give me that. Grab. Where are my cigarettes? Yes, good shit. Fishing line. That actually seems like it could be very useful. Grab all. And at worst case scenario, we can just eat them. Right. Are my hands already screwed? Damn it. I dropped that spare pair of socks as well. Never mind. Oh, no. Is there another survivor down here? Oh, my God. This is chaos. This is absolute chaos. This has completely changed the game. What have you got for me? Reading glasses. That's a shotgun. You hear that? What the hell was even that? Classic wristwatch. Not really interested. Uh, follow the carnage. Someone around here has a gun. I imagine they're probably in that house there. It's Neil. Neil, brother, you have really, really caused a scene. Can we not punch? Can we not just attack? Neil. Oh, we can kick. Push and kick. No! Neil, you fucking anus. I can't believe he's just locked me out. Right, I'm going to kill him. I uh, ban? Let me in, brother. Let me in. Oh, it's locked. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, God, someone's got a gun. Well, hopefully I'll take some of the distraction. I think we need to get out of here. This is chaos. Neil's, Neil is uh, really fucking things up. I think there's someone in there. Dr. Tracy. Dr. Tracy. I need a doctor. My hands are ragged right now. Stomp. Stomp. Dr. Tracy. Help me. Get back, you undead bastards. Dr. Tracy, let me help you. Or alternatively get savage so I can steal your stuff. Maybe I could kill Dr. Tracy. Yes, get her. 
<laughs> oh, doctor. I need your help. I'm kind of bleeding everywhere. So it's Tracy. Medical check. Do no, 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 doctor. Dr. Tracy. Survivor options. I can't, I can't call. I think it's because she's panicking. She does seem very panicked. Was that Liam? That certainly looks like the guy that, that was formerly Liam. I'm going to follow her around for a bit, see where she ends up going. Fuck fucking Christ. Good lord, madam. Who the hell's this? Speaking of Christ, hello? Is that... Oh my god. This feels like the infection's just started out, you know? Did she just... What the hell are you doing, Tracy? She's fucking doing me in. I've just been shanked by a doctor. Jesus, help me. Jesus, take the wheel. Did you see that? <laughs> Some fucking doctor you are. What the hell? We need to get ourselves patched up. Luckily, they've distracted the undead. So if we can find somewhere we can uh, chill out for a little while. Maybe get ourselves patched up here. I think this house is a pretty good candidate, huh? Oh, no. Massive blood loss. Oh, no. Massive blood loss. Oh, someone's already been here. Okay, okay. Remove broken glass. Requires an item in your left hand. What are you talking about? Pick up broken glass. Okay, okay. Here we go. Here we are. Uh, climb through. I don't care. Who cares if you get cut anymore, to be honest with you? Okay, okay. Give me uh, bed sheets, bed sheets, bed sheets. Can I not area select it? No, I don't care about that. Oh, fuck. Shut the curtains. Right, there's got to be something we can send ourselves with. You are going to survive this. Mark my words, my friend. I absolutely cannot believe we immediately got stamped by a fucking doctor. The irony. Oh, oh no. Oh, we're going the way of the DeMarcus duffel bag. Just please, just give me a chance to patch myself up for fuck's sake. Shut the door. Okay, okay, okay. Oh my god, it's chaos. Um, wash, wash yourself. Wash yourself. Right, okay. Uh, show me my... What, what have we got in here? Something we can tear up. Uh, I'm sorry, diamond sweater. You've got to go. Okay, get that shit torn up. Get that shit torn up. Oh my god, he's going to die. He's actually going to die. Terminal damage. Terminal damage. Give me a weapon. I'm going to kill that fucking doctor if that's the last thing I do. Bollocks. Turns out the door was booby trapped. <laughs> I will admit, look, I'm not doing super well this time, but I'm having a lot of fun just seeing the chaos unfolding. You know, it, it feels like it's kind of the, the, the start of the infection. You've got all these survivors running around. You've got chaos. You've got bodies everywhere. People fighting for their lives. So her name was something Judd. Now I'm going to call you, um, D Dread. Dread D Judge. <laughs> Let's do it. We are starting with that uh, with that same starting point again with the with the strong and athletic and the uh, everything else that I showed off at the start here. If I see Doctor, what was her name? Oh God, Doctor Judy. Um, she's dead. I'm telling you. Okay, we got a, we got another similar starting point to the one that we had last time. Let's immediately get to. I, I'm hoping we can find some sort of weapon this time around. Oh, not the plunger. You're not gonna make me. Okay, well, we'll equip it for the time being. If we don't find anything better, we've got at least something to defend ourselves with. I'm sure the damage on it is comical. Uh, that's a working magazine. Sure, sure. I shouldn't really maybe get to... That's better. I shouldn't probably get too weighed down by, um, you know, books. Seeing as we, we aren't going to really have chance to read books if we don't find a half-decent weapon. I'm, I'm fairly all right with this, though. I feel like this is not a terrible starting item. Right, let me in. What have you got for me? Another wristwatch, hopefully. Okay, and here we've got... Oh, speak of the devil and it shall appear. Okay, give me that. Do things spawn in the same place? I don't believe they do, because I don't recognize half these uh, half these items. I kind of hope they don't, you know? I'd assume it would be random anyway. There was, what, what the hell would be the point of the lucky perk in hindsight? Right. Uh, excuse me. You completely missed the exit. That gives me very little hope for your survivability, my friend. What have we got? Be bleach. Oh, look. It's, it's heavy. It's heavy. And to be frank... There's already gunshots. Uh, what about ketchup? Ketchup full of calories. Give me that. Peach. A tasty peach. Uh, canned potatoes. Okay, can opener. That's what we want. Right, move it, move over into this direction. What have you got for me then? Dish towel. Spoon. Uh, dish towel. Peanuts. Give me those. Water bottle. Excellent. Orange soda. Better than nothing. Where did those fucking... Ah, were they over here? Yeah, here we are. Pot no. Potatoes. Oh, let's just loot all this, this. I think we want all this stuff, don't we? Good work, good work, good work. That's something. Right, I'm, I'm committed to this character. I'm not going to fail you like I failed the last two. Okay, what have we got in here? Nothing, empty notebook. That's probably good. We're not wearing ourselves down with crap. Right, let's get to the shed immediately. 
see what we can find. The gunshot is going to provide a phenomenal distraction for us early on. Problem is, it's uh, in that direction over there. So the zombies are heading towards us here. Okay, be careful. Come on, get that window open. Nice work, nice work. Get in. Quickly see what they've got. Charcoal rope, not interested. Can we open the door? Yes, we can. Okay, good work. Oh my god, that sounds like it's coming from over here. That sounds like it's coming from this direction, but they're heading down there. Well, in that case, let's see if we can get in this house. Oh god, be careful. Okay. That guy is out for blood. That guy is out for blood. Let's put our pipe to good use here, people. Hello, sir. Would you like to meet my big lead pipe? Die. Good work. Okay, what have we got? Denim shorts. They're better. Wear them. How are denim shorts better? <laughs> what a time to be alive. Okay, open window. Oh, come on. Yes. Nice. We're in. We're in. We're in. Go, go, go. What have we got for me? Closed umbrella. That's a, that's a weapon. It's not really what I'm after, but it is a weapon nonetheless. Okay. Let's take a look around here. We got a bookshelf. Advanced farming. That's uh, optimistic, to say the least. Advanced farming requires kind of basic farming, which again requires not getting murdered in the first 30 seconds. <gasps> Fraser? He, he shouted at me. He said I was dead meat. Oh my god. Are we going to get some... A man trying to kill me? Corn beef. Corn beef. You come in here, I will, I will destroy you. Oh! No! No! Get him. Nice. Get him. Fuck him up. Oh no, you don't. Do him in. Kill him. Kill this man. He's got an axe. The bastard got me. Yes, she fucking did. She has a name, my friend. And that is Dread Judge. Get him. Get him. The bloodlust. The bloodlust. Oh, Fraser. Oh, it's a bad day to be you, my friend. Niles! Fuck him up! Oh my god, you can't push people over. Probably makes a lot of sense. Somebody's quite unsteady on their feet. You will never, if you escape into the woodlands, you will never escape. Come on! Get him! Oh my god, that zombie is moving with haste. What the fuck? Oh, it's a man! Jonathan! Jonathan, help me! Jonathan's after him. Ashley's after him. We've got a squad. We have quite the squad. If I can kill him, he's got a fucking axe. I want it. Oh my god, I hope you see Jonathan and Ashley. Get me. I thought it was a zombie moving at haste then. It was just uh, just some survivors. Come on, get him. He's quite clearly a, a bandit, a pirate, a brigand. I didn't mean to hit you. Oh my god, I think I just got a, a hit on the wrong person. Come on. We can get him, we can get him. Got him! We actually got him. Okay, what have we got here? I want the axe. Can I, can I have the axe? It's on the floor. Unstoppable. Let me find my let me find my saviors here. Fuck. Don't, please. Please. I'm so well armed. Oh, bollocks. I didn't even consider that. We've just been running around like a fucking blue ass fly for 20 minutes. Okay, get out of here. Okay, okay. Frasier? Frasier? No, he's the man we killed. Ashley? Jonathan. 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 You're a good man. Don't barge it. Oh, please let me in. Let me in. Let me in. They're, they're, they're like barricading themselves in. Let me in. I'll help you. We're good friends. We defeated that menace together. No, 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 let me in. For fuck's sake. Jonathan. <gasps> Best boy. Close curtains. Close curtains. Jonathan. Can I can I talk to him? He seems very preoccupied. Talk. Well, that happened earlier. Actually, don't worry about that. I love him. Let me marry you. Who's your, who's your friend? Who the hell's this? He's dropped a gun. They've, they've killed someone else. These people are fucking... Right, double, double wristwatch time. Oh my god, they've... There were people in here. Wow, this is crazy. Jonathan, my man. Jonathan, invite to group. Want to join my group? Agreed! We've got a friend? Oh, we've got a friend. Give order, give order. Jonathan, give order. Barricade. Agreed, thank you. Oh, balls. Jonathan, can you barricade this one? Because I don't know how to do that. <laughs> Where did your friend go? Okay, let's shut the curtain. Might, 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 might slobber down by a second, you know? Oh, no. I think I've just broken in. What do I do? You're fine, you're fine, you're fine. Hold, hold up, hold up, hold up. You're fine. Where did his friend go? Just me and Jonathan out on the open road. Oh, he's doing a great job, though. I mean, we've got to give credit to this guy. Yeah, I mean, he's incredible. We've got ourselves a base. Okay, sugar. What else we got here? Uh, I mean, I don't know why I'm looting. We're probably going to just hunker down here, aren't we? 
The guy's done an incredible job. Let me transfer my food over. Corn beef, potato, boil and mash them, stick them in a stew, put in container. Yeah, here we go. So I've now got to keep an eye on Jonathan and our character. He's fine, though. He's absolutely fine. Great work, Jonathan. Um, can you barricade this? Um, Jonathan, uh, barricade, brother. Uh, give order. Barricade. Got it. Hopefully, he'll just, he'll just work on that. I don't know if you even can barricade anymore, to be honest with you. Okay, let's keep going. I'm so glad we've already got... Ashley, hello! Are you, are you my friend? Call over. Hello there. Ashley, invite to group. No way! No way? Really? Ashley? Uh, we've got friends. Guys, we've got friends. Where's our character's axe gone? Sorry, just to, just to check. Where's, where's our character's axe gone? Uh, axe, 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 axe. Wood axe, wood axe, wood axe. Gripping both hands. I guess it's because we were doing something else. Is, that, is Ashley in a little bit of trouble here? You want me to, want me to help? She's got a good rhythm going. She's got a great rhythm going. Oh, dear. Come on, join me. You're great. Uh, invite to group. Sure thing. She's in. Okay, guys, we are in a little bit of trouble here. I won't lie to you. Um, oh, my God. I haven't got another wrist to put that on. House key. Bit pointless. Let's get this. Get that worn. Okay, okay, okay. We're fine. Right, we come first, okay? Shh, shh, don't tell them that. We come first. Okay, we always come first. Okay, let's get out into the world then and see what we can find. I don't like the idea of using that as our base because firstly it's got, you know, it's, it's just a bit large. Are they coming with me? They are. Nice. I want to find somewhere smaller, a bit more defensible, somewhere that doesn't have so many entrance points, it, you know, doors that we can't really do much about. I don't think that's a great idea. Um, either that, we find somewhere really, really large and hunger down in a smaller section of it, allowing us to get out and loot a little bit easier. This is quite a small house over here. I'm a big fan of that one. We want somewhere where we're not going to be kind of blindsided by zombies being just on top of us. Or we've got this big place over here that we saw. This is where the hall was outside of. And it's a bit more dangerous being in a bigger area, but it gives us plenty of things to loot. You know, plenty of food. We could really hunker down for a little while. Because once we've got the building secure, as long as we don't fuck around too much, we should be fine. Don't you guys get bitten? Don't you guys get bitten? We're not going to get many friends out here. <laughs> Is it dead? You know what? I'll leave them to deal with that one. I'll deal with this one. Ugh. Come on. Fall. 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 Jonathan, I had him. Brother. You're, you're, these two have got like bloodlust. They are too excited to get in there. Here we are. I guess we're in. Jonathan's locked Ashley out. Jonathan is compulsion with shutting every fucking door he sees. Oh, yeah. I don't know if this is good. Hmm. We get upstairs, though. Get upstairs. That's a bit more defensible, isn't it? A bit more safe. Oh! No! There's a, there's a hostile man. Kill him. I think we've killed more bloody... Oh, my God! I think we've killed more human beings than we've killed zombies at this point. Drop him. Jonathan, for fuck's sake. Forget about Ashley. Bandaging up her arm. Yeah, bandage this bitch. Kill him. Oh, no. Let's just kill the man. I just killed a man for defending himself. Well, that's okay. He kind of deserved it. Right. Okay. Can we can we barricade down here? We need to find someone with food. This is not this is not ideal. This is really not ideal. Do schools have food? I mean, this is America. Gooby Doo, Spiffos. What is that? What's that van? Let's go and let's go and grab that. See if we can. If we honestly, uh, it, genuinely, if we can open this thing up, and if we can if if we can go in in this van, I'm I'm. One. This is officially the best game of all time. Just me, Jonathan, and Ashley in our mystery machine. You absolute fool. No! I didn't want you to fucking automatically climb through, you moron. Kill him! Oh, I'm so annoyed at her already. I'm so annoyed at her already. No! Get away from me. I refuse to die. We've got our axe. We've got our friends. That's everything I ever needed in one of these runs. Right. Bandage yourself up. Quick, 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 quick. Where are our friends? What the fuck are they doing? There they are. Okay, cover me, cover me, cover me, cover me, cover me, cover me. Jonathan. Jonathan, brother, please cover. Jonathan, brother, please cover. Shit, I'm hurt. No, you're done for. You're done for. He's infected. We're in. We got keys. We got fuel. What's going on? I don't know how to drive. Is this good? It's making a noise. Oh, it's out of it's out of fuel. It's out of fuel. Oh no. Shit. We were able to get in, but it's broken down. All right, it's every man for himself. It's Jesus again. Graham, join my group. 
Graham, join me. Offer to join group. Invites, invites group. Sounds good. We've got another one. We've got another one, boys. Although I seem to have lost two, so it's not really much of a help. Oh my good god. Jonathan, we could be in a little bit of trouble here, pal. <laughs> oh, oh no. Oh god. We haven't been bitten yet. We're okay. We're okay. We're doing fine. We're doing fine. How's Jesus? Oh, Jesus is dead. Oh, Lord. I need to get out of here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We really do. We really do. You're right. A.A. Ron. A.A. Ron. Distract him for me while I go patch myself up. Thank you. Your sacrifice won't be forgotten. Come on. Get in there. Oh, not in that one. Okay. No, sorry. I didn't mean this house. Chaos. Just fucking chaos. Just chaos. Now I see why we did so well as Demarcus. These cities are doomed. Well, well, then, in that case, I will follow Demarcus's mighty teachings and I will flee into the woods with my mighty wood axe, which seems actually fairly appropriate in hindsight. Freedom. Freedom. I have no idea if our friends have survived. Oh, my God, a dead survivor. I have no idea if our friends have survived. But we have. And that's all that's important. Okay, let's slow our roll a little bit here. Okay. I think we've actually escaped all of those. <gasps> Ashley's alive. Ashley's fucking alive. Where's Jonathan? <gasps> Michael. Michael, you have a key to this car? Michael. Call over. Hey, over here. Invite to group. You want to join my group? That's the plan. What a guy. What a guy. Can we get in this car? Oh, shit. What, what seat am I in? Is it a big driver's seat? Driver's seat. Oh, it's empty again. Jesus. Oh. oh, my God. There's a group of survivors. Oh, my God. They're shooting at me. You can't. You can't shoot at me. I can't believe that. And another group of survivors. Maybe this is their base. Right. You're so dead. You think you can fucking shoot me? She's probably killed us. I won't lie. I'm not going down without a fight. Fuck her up, Michael. Bandaging left shin. Yeah, I'll bandage this. Okay, that was a, <laughs> a lackluster, I will admit. Just don't just don't give a chance to shoot again. No. No, 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 no. No! <gasps> Ashley. You fucking killed Ashley. You're dead. You are dead, Abigail. You are so dead. I will avenge my good friend. That man's got a, a, a pan, so I'm not too concerned about him. Fuck off, Barry, with your stupid hipster glasses. Oh, sorry, his name's Ryan. I don't know how I read that as Barry. <laughs> oh, Abigail. <laughs> oh, Abigail. Do not think you can run. Oh, it's Barry again. Fuck off, Barry. Get her. She's going to try and reload, and then she's going to kill us. Come on. Swing your axe. Jesus, you've got axe skill, and you've got big muscles. <gasps> I've pushed her into a state of suspended animation. Now do her in. Finish her off. Nice. One more hit. The zombies. <laughs> ah. That, my friends, is poetic justice. You can get away. Get away. I want to watch Abigail die. Yes. Vengeance. Vengeance, my friends. Oh, my God. There's so many of them. Get in this house. I recognize this house from Demarcus's adventures. He's barricaded us out. He's barricaded us out. He actually has. That's why it's called Barry. It's short for Barricade. That's our next character right there. Get in. No! Oh, we're fucking dead again. We're fucking dead again. This is chaos. Um, I like it, but my god, there. I, I think... Managing survivors on top of also managing our own stuff is just insanity. I think really what we need to do is get a good base somewhere we can bring survivors back to and have them farm for us and shit. The last thing we need to do is be trying to survive and get ourselves equipped whilst also worrying about other people. Wow, that was uh, that was chaos. Let's leave it there. Uh, tomorrow I will I will I'll make it my honest best attempt. This was just really a kind of an experiment to see you know survivor mechanics, see what was going on. Tomorrow we will make a I, I will make my best attempt to. Give you guys a, a long-term character like Demarcus Duffelbag. Uh, and I think we've got to play as Barry Cade, haven't we? I think we have to play as Barry Cade. Survivor Wrangler and all-time best boy. Only out really to defend himself, if nothing else. Thank you to Alchemia, KQ, the Magic Flying Velociraptor, Tremere, Regent, Jess, Dante, Mordekane, Cat, X, Dr. Don, MD, Dumbgit, Rage Dragon, I'm Sagatair, Commissar, Taj, Solothol, 
German Hammer, Jobo Daddy, Sirik 313, Arctic Knight, Thor, JT, 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 Emily, and everyone else at the executive producer tier over on Patreon for voting for Project Zomboid as our current and newest series. Big thank you to those guys. Thank you as well, of course, to Anna Aurora, Lady Cerulean, Matteo, Nox Immortalis, Smurtworm, Struck Iron, Mr. Awesome, Callum James 3, Roger Wilco, Bare Minimum, Cass, Lilac, and thanks for the loan, Bojo, as well.